Lubyanka building, KGB headquarters in Moscow. The sleeper agent records are stored in the archives 100 feet below ground in a nuclear defense command bunker. Your only way in or out is through this high security elevator. We'll need proper credentials. That's where our asset, Belikov, comes into play. Belikov has been our source inside the KGB for nearly a decade. He'll get us in. He came through for us in Yamantown. He'll do it again. This shit is crazy, even by his standards. You sure he's on board? An immediate nuclear threat warrants every risk at this point. I'm sure he wouldn't disagree. Sims, get Belikov on the line. Алло, Беликов на трубке. Извините, я думал, что это песок с пол Сингапура. We're almost to the tunnels. Do you get access to the bunker? There's always a problem. Solve it. you at the basement entrance once you have the bunker key. Kamra Belikov, you've been summoned to the conference room upstairs. Secretary Gorbachev is here from the Central Committee. I'm sorry. You just have to come back to me. I see. Did the general come through to you? And this is as far as I can take you today. Have you ever been to Poland? Comrade Belikov, <laughs> have a seat. General Secretary Brezhnev has taken an interest in the new security development. <laughs> There's a mole within the KGB. <laughs> The committee wants someone from the first chief directorate to oversee Colonel Kravchenko's investigation. If you've not met him already, this is Imran Zakayev. Thank you, Secretary Gorbachev. And thank you all for welcoming me with open arms. I can think of no greater tragedy than a home violated from the inside. The trust and love within a family is sacred. Apparently. Not everyone shares your beautiful sentiments. <coughs> Comrade Belikov, <coughs> as head of security, I understand you've practically exhausted yourself trying to unearth this mole. How has that gone? <coughs> <coughs> I am not a patient man, Belikov, or a compassionate one. Until the mole is found, I want security increased around the bunker. Zakayev, do you have any recommendations? We should restrict bunker access. We also want to cultivate closer relationships with all of you. I want to know your hopes, your fears, your ambitions. Be thorough, but we don't want any significant disruptions. And you, you Belikov? Who do you think should retain bunker access during the investigation? Comrade Belikov, my apologies. Even your bunker access has been revoked. We can't be too cautious, can we? Secretary Gorbachev, I believe it would be best if only General Charkov retains his bunker key for now. Very well. See to it. Worry yourself no longer, sir. I've already ordered the bunker keys collected from the men. Comrade Belikov, we are in grave danger from the capitalists. Our collective, our very way of life is at risk. <coughs> the traitor will be caught. And he will pay a high price for his betrayal. Belikov, you are dismissed.
I'm being watched. I need a bunker key. Now, first, I'll have to kill the cameras. Have you ever been to Poland? So. This area is restricted. If I'm spotted, well, can I help you, sir? Blow my cover. Now I need to hide the body. I have to get a bunker key for Adler. He'll need it to access the vault. <sighs> Unfortunately, Cherkov now has the only one. Need something. We don't want an update. Everything is fine. Okay. Mirikov, have you dug up my mood? No matter. We've discovered additional unauthorized communications. Within hours, we will know the exact computer they came from. Comrade. Uh, I will be exposed soon. In the server room, I could point evidence towards Cherkov.
Comrade Zakayev is still waiting for us. Okay, Sergeant Torbikov, I'm checking the job. Mirikov, have you dug up my mood? Cherkov, <laughs> that's absurd. Where is your evidence? Uh, I have no idea how this got past me. Cherkov will be passing through here soon. When he does, we will apprehend him. General Sharko, just how long have you been spitting on Mother Russia? Excuse me? Do you know who you're speaking to? I do now. Your medals will no longer protect you. Please empty your pockets on the counter. Colonel, have you lost your mind? Now step over there and lift your arms to the side. You're serious? Fucking do it. Is this your way of setting up my fall, Koshenko? Hmm? I'm looking forward to hearing the response of the Central Committee. Me too. Now go in that room without saying another fucking word. Anything else you need to tell me, you can do it in there. Okay, now I need to head to the basement and let Adler's team in. How can I help you, sir? Ludden. Ah, Adler's team will need uniforms to get past security. Luring two soldiers into the tunnel should do the trick. Bielikov here. Send a security detail to meet me in the furnace room. Immediately. Wasn't sure you'd come through. I don't have much choice, do I? This keycard gives you elevator access to the bunker. What about uniforms? Shh, sounds like they're here now. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. This keycard gives you elevated access to the bunker. What about uniforms? Shh, sounds like they're here now. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. Now, take cover. Keep it clean. Uniforms are no good to us, bloody. Там, там, там. Я нашел не запертую дверь. Нету никакого оправдания этой некомпетентности. У нас есть очень строгие протоколы, чтобы это предотвратить. Понятно? Окей, я должен уйти, но у вас должно быть все, что вам нужно. Теперь, если остановить, 
You are reporting to Commander Sobel. Get changed. No metal detectors for us. We're going around. И куда это вы направляетесь? Досмотр обязателен. Для всех, без исключения. Вы должны пройти досмотр. Товарищ, доставьте вашу сумку сюда для досмотра. Давайте он едем к обиности. Дайте нам пройти. Не принимайте это близко к сердцу, товарищ. У меня приказ досматривать всех, без исключения. Товарищ, ты нужен за Кайву. Я разберусь. Спасибо, товарищ. Поздравите, Беликов. По-моему, я здесь, нет? Пойдем. Вы прибыли. Ах да, разумеется. То ваш командир, я не расслышал. Вы что, с дураками не дерзите? Кто вы такие? Elevator conversation always gets awkward. You're up. They won't be happy to see us down here. Wait for my word. И прежде чем Кравченко успел. А ну-ка, оружие на зеленый!
moving! Please go south. We need to secure our expo. Plant a gas canister in the vent. Good. Let's get to the vault. the list bell. Copy it to a disc. Let's go! <laughs> Running out of time, Bell. I'm cutting through. Through the door. Get ready. Here they come. down. Follow me. This way. Surrender. You will not get away. Time for plan B, Bell. Activate the gas. Drop your weapons and surrender or die. When we move, get a mask on Belikov. I'll cover you. What's the 
situation up top. They are on full alert, melting the building down. We'll have to fight our way out. We're gonna need some heavier gear. I know just the place, my friend. They are heavy weapons by the elevator and what they brought to the We need to arm ourselves before the force when they arrive. Давай, 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 keep moving. They need us this way. Southwest courtyard in five minutes. Velikov is hitching a ride. Plenty of room in the taxi. Once we get off the elevator, just keep moving towards the courtyard. Get the charge ready, though. Let's go, Bell. For your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight. Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who can bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the States. It's time to take down Perseus, once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, 
There's no turning back. Woods. Don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah. You've got my sure as shit guarantee on you. Man, have a what? What's up? I need a few minutes of your time to discuss it. You available? Ready to roll. You ready? Let's talk. You look ready. Yeah. Check this out. Damn. Look alive. It's Adler's protege. Well. Are you fucking serious right now? Don't get him started. Nah, 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 nah. Hold on. Let me set the record straight. Here we go. <laughs> so, yeah. Castro and I have some history between us. I had the opportunity to off the man, but our intel was flubbed. That's in a tidal wave of shit all the way up to D.C. So if I find out that Perseus is in cahoots with Castro, and Hudson happens to find one of my bullets in Fidel's head, well, I say chalk it up to collateral damage. Huh. Kept it under five minutes. I was expecting a diatribe. No, we were after a different spy in Quezon. Huh, that's right. Our team was right next to Adler's when we touched down in Way City. That's also the first time I had the misfortune of meeting Hudson. <laughs> in all those years, nothing's changed. He still has the personality of a wet fucking blanket. <laughs> you hear that? We're fucking legends. Yeah. Wherever we go, we bring the thunder. Man, get the fuck out of here with that shit. You seem pretty unimpressed over in Fake Town, USA. Or, are you talking about Mason right now? As I live and breathe. You got a point in saying that? You sound concerned, too. If you're trying to be friendly, this is the dumbest way to go about it. We're just fucking with you. <laughs> <laughs> he should be concerned. Yeah, well, you just snuck into the KGB with Adler, hacked their database, and got out in one piece. And I'll be going in with my boy here. If I were Perseus, I'd be running for the hills. And I'd be calling in a mortar strike on that hill. Yeah, for Adler, it's a culmination of three decades of meticulous tracking. You'll probably be extra pissy on this mission. I advise you to stay focused and drop the nostalgia. Good. Then you're ready. Yep. Later, Bell. Hold on. Make it quick. I'm busy. Indeed it did. Our insider delivered in a big way. As for you, the baseline expectation around here is to surpass every expectation. So from the bottom of my ass, welcome to the team. Plan A is Agent Azale. We didn't pick Lazar for his charisma. He's an expert in bomb defusal. If it's live and he can't disarm it, you're still gonna get that nuke out of there. Bring a change of pants. Negative. Even at this size, Perseus could catch our scent on the wind and try to relocate. In this scenario, less is more. It's as good as it's gonna get. The intelligence community has spent years trying to trek Perseus to a concrete location. This guy lives between the lines of recorded history. Nothing would put a bigger smile on my face than you personally putting him down. I'm not in the business of discussing my personal views on team members to subordinates. Anything else? 
The projector's in the back corner if you need to go over any details from the briefing. I think we're done here. 